Right guys, here we are, number 7 on the list of the NFL's top 100 players in 2022. Devontae, better fucking execution, Adams. Let's get into it. Who is this? Yeah. <laughs> uh, look at him, he's working on that tan. Good to see you, bro. <laughs> oh. oh yeah! Yeah, it's good to see him, isn't it? I'll tell you what, Devontae Adams, look, am I going to go down a rabbit hole? No, no I'm not, but I will tell you something just quick, quickly, even though I've taken 10 seconds of your time already. Um, Devontae Adams is not a player I took seriously until probably a year and a half ago. I saw him as a Packer. I didn't really see him, well, I didn't really see him play, to be honest. I was following other teams, uh, what have you. And then I did happen to watch a couple of Packers games over the years, and I, and I, and I, I saw him get 100 yards, 150 yards with ease. Um, you know, so then... You've really got no choice but to start respecting the man. And, and you know, with that, for me, uh, means I'm a fan. I'm a big fan. Number 17 for the Raiders is going to be very, very interesting to see how he performs um, with the likes of Derek Carr. Let's get into it. It's good to see you in that yeah. silver and black. Oh, hey, look. oh, yeah, you. this your first time, huh? Yeah. Look at man. The jersey, I told her, I said it's, it really hit me today. It really hit you. Yeah. Silver and black. Let's talk. Uh, now that's some Adams consistency. Many people. Number one. Number one. Best receiver. <laughs> you know, he quite, quite possibly could be the best receiver in the league. He's arguably one of the best in the game right now, if not the best. He's one of those guys, he can do everything. They send him vertical, you know, single him up backside. They let him work all the different areas of the field. That's why he's one of the best in the business. Was that off the helmet? Uh, that's another reason why he's one of the best in the business. Touchdown hookup, and they have become yep. the most productive touchdown tandem in Packers history. Love you, love you. And I feel like he's kind of at the elite level of every single one of those things you're asking a receiver to do. He's the best receiver in the league, and that's how he practices, and that's how he plays. Like, you better put... 11 on me to stop me. I'm just that guy. He wants to win every rep. Pro Bowler on Pro Bowl. Oh, well, he won that one. And with that in mind, let's have a look at his stats because I can't remember. I want his pre draft measurables at the very least. I know he's 6 to 100 kg. But what else can we see? Nick Minnett. 29, December 24th, 1992. 6 foot 1. 98 kg. Either way, I was close. Fresno State from 2011 to 13 uh, got picked up in the second round of the 2014 draft with pick number 53. Went to the Packers from 14 to 21, then to the Raiders currently. A two-time first-team All-Pro selection 2020 and 2021. Five-time Pro Bowler in 2017, 18, 19, 20 and 21. NFL receiving touchdowns leader in 2020. And I feel like that's, and I think that's probably when I began giving him the respect he deserved. Two seasons with Fresno State. Got over 3,000 yards. 38 receiving touchdowns. That's ridiculous. When was he drafted? Second round. Late in the second round, 2014. 456 for the 40 yard dash. 682 for the three cone drill. 39 and a half inches on the vertical jump. Now that's probably top, I'm going to say top four on this list. 10 foot three on the broad jump. 14 reps on the bench. Let's have a look at his deal. Let's have a look at this. Ugh. Signed a five-year, $141.25 million deal, making him the highest-paid wide receiver in the NFL at the time of his signing. The trade also reunited Adams with his college quarterback, Derek Carr. I did see that. I saw that in Derek Carr's video, I think, with both playing together at Fresno State from 2012 to 2013. He's been in the league for eight years. He's, definite, he's a definite veteran, 116 games, 8,121 yards averaging over a thousand per season with his career high coming last year 1553 11 touchdowns last year his career high was the year before with 18 bringing his total career receiving touchdowns in 116 games to 73 let's keep going in my opinion he's he's the best receiver uh, in the league right now uh, that I've covered. You almost got out on that too. I did. I pushed him and he grabbed my arm and like tripped me. A great throw and a great catch beats good coverage. Yeah. Hey, 
Just remember, you're deep and you know where 17 is at all times. One-on-one -on -one coverage. I don't care who's not Devontae Adams. That ball is going out there. Obviously, he's good at everything. Yeah. But to you, what makes him the best? Because he bright his heart. He competes. See, that's the thing. You don't see behind the scenes, right? You see guys like Tom Brady coming back to the field a couple of days after winning the Super Bowl. You know, practicing again, again, and again. And that just screams class, right? It screams longevity in the game. And it seems Devontae is no different. Tay to one, because he's competitive. No, I mean, he's not selfish. He's competitive. It's a big difference. He didn't inch back. He, no, he stood he there. Stood he stood firm. He just stood there. He just stood the line, bro, so I just, uh, he just took off. Uh. I was really in the flesh with him, so I really got to see how he worked in person. Tay a different animal. Devontae Adams became the first receiver in league history with 115 catches, 1,350 yards, and 11 touchdowns in back-to-back -back seasons. Shit. I mean, he's all about the work. He doesn't have to. He doesn't have to show it on social media for him to be doing. I'm gonna say that's surprising. Not so much the receptions or the yards, but the amount of touchdowns. So I mean, it shows up week in, week out on the field. Cause you know he's doing. I mean, these stat guys, they can pull a record out of the hat at any time. I mean, really. Uh, <laughs> I'm not gonna say it's bad, but it's kind of like dark magic. Something right in the offseason and training. Lost it over the middle for Devontae. He's got it at the 50. Oh, Devontae look at that. Pirouette, 360. Great job, Tay! Let's go. Oh, sensational grab on the right side. What a catch! Yeah. Rainbow's right side, Devontae! Makes the catch! And the Packers are in business. Oh. That is so tough. I couldn't catch that 99 out of 100 times, but the, the one time I did... Yeah, I don't know where I'm going with that. All, all day, bro. And he has some of the nastiest routes. Every route looks like he's going deep. Just his quickness and suddenness. I don't know who routes are better out of him and, and Cooper Cup. I don't know uh, both of them run some amazing routes. It's that hop, isn't it? It's the hop. It's the, um, it's the, it's the doubt, that, 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 that slither, slither of doubt that you're putting in the defensive player's mind. Which gives him the jump. It's like he has the patience to... Well, I was about to say it's too easy, but no. He did have to take the contact and had to hold on to the ball. Do it, you know, to where it's almost basketball on the grass. You can tell we played basketball. He loses a lot of his basketball moves on them boys. He doesn't give you a chance to get your hands on him. With respect to route running, where creating separation is the name of the game, Adams has indeed separated himself from his competition. You gotta love a bit of separation, guys. He's faster than you think. His deceptive speed. I didn't think he was that fast, but hey, he got me the one that I said, okay, I'll skip the speed. He gets a lot of yak after the, after the catch, man. He tends to shake and juke and all that. And nine times out of ten, he will get you. Great, yet subtle move after the catch. Just like that. You can't sit in a chair with Devontae. He makes uh, a lot of guys sit uh, in Sticks chair. his foot in the ground. Wonder if he's had any knee injuries. See violently steps. I'll say that much. Ugh. Here we go. How does 17 get that over? What are we going to see here? Bang! Laters. <laughs> yeah, this one catch against Cincinnati. You got to get that one on film. Tell you what, these are some real bangs off the right. Bangs? Is there a plural for bang? No, there's not. This guy is a hot stepper. Oh, a wee bit of a dead leg. See, shows and goes. And he's off. And he's off. And he's got the speed to do it too. Oh. Safety went with a run read. Mate. Flat footed. Devontae to stutter and go. Just a stutter and, and that's go. That's all he needs. He just needs a little bit of space. Beautiful to watch. 
absolutely beautiful to watch. That's a hell of a play. Mm. There's a lot. Hell of a play, hell of a, hell of a route, hell of a throw, hell of a player. And that brings us to the end of yet another video. We're in the top six now, guys. Who's it going to be? Well, as we know, the uh, NFL's really done us dirty here. But we do have... One of these ballots here. The linebacker of the Steelers. The 2021... NFL sack leader with 22 and a half, TJ Watt. Thanks for watching, guys. Thanks for the memories. It's been incredible. We're almost done for another year, and then we're into the regular season. Thank you, and good night.